Howdy viewers, Arthmail returning with my Let's Play series. Now I'm just starting off into Nephilim Rifts, or I should say I was starting off. I did make a video yesterday, but unfortunately for some reason it didn't seem to capture correctly, so I'm, I missed a little bit of gameplay. I've got a few extra legendary items since that video, so we've managed to get from Kadala the Jade Harvester's Boots, uh, Thing of the Deep Mojo, and a Blackthorn's chest armor. So we were a little bit more tanky, I suppose, and we're heading into Torment 1, which I'm finally looking forward to, hoping to get some more gear. We'll head into a rift and pretty much just follow through till we reach the Rift Guardian and then most likely end the video there. <clears throat> See how we go. I've got a couple of different skills. I'm using my... Um, Corpse spiders now, just because with my mimics they seem to do a lot better job. I'm sort of going to avoid picking up a lot of objects at the moment. Uh, we'll see how we go. I seem to run out of um, stash base rather quickly, so go for a little wander over here. Nice chest. Oh, and I'm glad we checked that chest. Got ourselves some champions here with reflect damage, which could be fun, as always. We seem to be tanking pretty well. I'm really looking, obviously, to get some more set pieces. I particularly want to do a bit of a pet build with this Witch Doctor. I think it would work the best. Try not to get in the middle of the fire chains there. We will we'll be dead. And we've gone up another Paragon level, which is good. A bit messy and a bit noisy with the spiders, but they seem to do a pretty good job and they sort of slow everything down so it doesn't get close enough to cause me any great harm. Just check down this way, see if there's anything. Not really. <clears throat> Oh, and we've got another set of champions over here. And reflect damage again. <laughs> Seems to be a regular thing. Oh, we'll get out of the frozen. The little um, <coughs> troops of the dead. My fetishes, my zombie dog and my gargantuan seem to be tanking a lot of the damage for us. Which is sort of the intention I wanted for this particular build for a hardcore character, I think. Try not to get myself right in the middle of things where I'm going to regret it. Gold always comes in handy. I'm also hoping to put up another video today, just of one I've been trialling out, which is with my normal character, my Demon Hunter, utilising the Talia set with Reign of Vengeance. Um, it's just in its infant stages, like I really need to find some better gear and that sort of stuff, but it's quite effective. Uh, it's fun in T6 Rifts. You're pretty mobile all the time, and I don't know, I enjoy it. I'm just going for everything here. <laughs> well, I'm trying to keep an eye on my health, of course. My mimics are definitely helping. Definitely need to find some better gear. That's what's holding us back, I think, at the moment. But being seasons, and not that they've announced the date that this season ends yet, but it won't be too far off, I wouldn't think. And I can hear a goblin in the background somewhere. I 
Let's hope he's got some legendaries for us. Let's see if my guys can keep up with him. Oh great, now we've got some elites involved. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry if I sound a bit worse for wears. I've had a bit of a cold lately, so it hasn't really helped. Oh. Get the goblin. How many times do you just race around the map just chasing just the goblin? <laughs> and inevitably leads to death if there's an elite pack following him. And we didn't even get a legendary. Oh, get out of the way of that. We're not doing too bad, we're nearly halfway through the rift. Or to the rift guardian I should say, so that's good. Throwing everything at us. And I'll try and throw as much as I can back. Right. Just pick up some of these crafting items. <coughs> Head down this way, see what we can find. Pass my horn around a few times. Piranhas are such a good little crowd control device. Set of reflect damage, guys. Joyous. Don't go that way. We go after these guys because they seem to cause more trouble running around trying to avoid us. Oh, and we've got four techs. So it'll be interesting to see what um, <clears throat> new items are going to introduce for the next season. I know that I saw an interview with White Cheng and they were talking about um, some more stuff to do with the Witch Doctor. I think they're going to finally probably fix um, the Helltooth set, which is based around zombie, Wall of Zombies. Which I tried to make something work for that, but it just didn't seem to go anywhere. I was trying a cold sort of build that <coughs> still wasn't doing the the sort of damage and survivability that you want, so unfortunately that didn't last long. But I'm sure if they make some improvements to the set and maybe team up a mojo or something that helps give it a bit more of a bonus. These guys are really spread out everywhere. I thought I'd be a lot further on than this. I'd say they're the most favourite of my enemies, all these guys. Some of them are real pain. But then again, this is only like, well, it's my second time trying a Torment 1 Rift because my first video didn't work, but still. Okay, we've got some more champions over here. Right, 
suck more up into the piranhas. I don't think it really worked because they got away. Oh, and they've got frozen as well. Great. And poison. And wall. Uh, have I got two lots here, maybe? Must have. Great, two lots of champions. Whoa. We'll try not to die here. This could be fun. Oh. And fast, obviously, because this guy's just speeding around like anything. Yeah, this is not fun. I'm trying to get out of this poison. Where is he? Who's still causing us grief? Someone's around somewhere causing grief. They're still dropping poison puddles. Did he go this way? Nope. Ah. <sighs> Must be up here somewhere. Ah. Oh. It's like hidden. Trapped. Yeah, I might. Oops. Pick up that amulet. You never know. <clears throat> We're still in need of a new amulet. And there's another set of elites. And poison again. Fast. Fuck. Now we had all reflect damage ones. Now we've got all fast ones with play. Get these guys first, then we can focus on the other dude. Get in. And hopefully it'll be someone that's going to be fairly easy and not take too long. Um, Zimba. That's not too bad. Could be worse. Just got to avoid his little... Um, Fetish things he generates. Can't remember what they're called now. Total mind blank. Don't like my little army following you, do you, mate? So we'll pick up everything he dropped and we'll head back to town. I'm sure there's some nice little things there. Well, not too bad. We still need some better items, but I'm pleased to be like doing Torment 1 Rifts, that's for sure. So we got a ring. Let's just quickly check that out. Oh, we got the new Short Man's Finger. Gargantuan summons three smaller versions. Might actually try that out, I think, because it's pretty cool and we don't really need our Ring of Grandeur at the moment. So we'll swap that over, we'll hang on to our Ring of Grandeur and we'll recast our Gargantuans. Nice. We've got a lot more pets now. That's cool. Oh, well, next video we'll be able to go through and um, see how they perform. Thanks for joining me and hopefully I'll have another video up in the next few hours.